Hi students, welcome back to physics class. In this class, I am going to teach 12th standard physics, lesson number 6, volume 2, ray optics. What is ray optics? The path of the light rays is called ray of the light. What is beam of light? Bundle of ray or collection of ray of light is called beam of light. What is reflection? A ray of light falling on a body having a shiny polished and a smooth surface alone is bounced back. This bouncing back of the light rays as they fall on smooth shiny and polished surface is called reflection. For example, take a plane mirror okay how will you make mirror highly polished metal aluminium or silver is coated one side of the glass plate is make mirror the mirror can reflect 90 percentage of light falling on them so take a plane mirror focus the light from the sun on the wall we can able to see bright spot on the wall due to reflection of light by the mirror because the mirror is a highly polished shiny smooth surface Suppose the mirror is not highly polished smooth, is rough means we cannot able to see the light spot on the wall. So light bouncing back after falling on the shiny smooth polished surface is called reflection of light. Law of Reflection Incident Ray The light ray falling on the shiny surface of reflecting body is called incident ray. Reflected ray After falling on the reflecting surface, this ray written back in same medium is called reflected ray. Normal line An imaginary line perpendicular to the point of Reflecting surface at the point of incidence of the light ray is called normal. Next, law of reflection. So here, xy, xy is a plane mirror. A O of light ray is falling on the plane mirror. At a point O, so A O is called incident ray. The plane mirror reflects the incident ray along O B. So O B is called reflecting ray. Imaginary perpendicular line drawn at a point of incidence is called normal line. Angle between incident ray and normal that is angle A O N is called angle of incidence I. The angle between reflected ray B O and normal O N that is B O N is called angle of reflection R. So from the diagram conclusion two laws fundamental laws. First one, the incident ray, reflected ray and normal to the reflecting surface are all coplanar. Coplanar means lie in the same plane, meet the same plane, travel in the same plane. The angle of incidence I is equal to the angle of reflection R. So angle I equal to angle R. Types of 
reflection of light Re regular reflection irregular reflection regular reflection or specular reflection when a beam of light that is a collection of ray of light falls on smooth surface its get reflected the reflected rays are parallel to each other so it's will be law of reflection that is angle of incidence equal to angle of reflection to produce clear image example reflection of light by plane mirror or reflection of light by surface of still water produces clear image so this types of reflection is called regular reflection or specular reflection irregular reflection when a beam of light rays falls on the rough surface that is irregular surface will get reflected the reflected rays is not parallel to each other do not obey law of reflection not produced clear image example reflection of light from wall is an regular reflection angle of deviation due to reflection here x y x y is a plane mirror a o incident light o b reflected light o b is reflected light o c undeviated light which is continue along the incident light ao the angle between ob oc this is this is the angle of deviation d the angle of deviation d equal to 180 degree minus 2i so here angle of deviation d equal to 180 degree minus angle of incidence plus angle of reflection by the law of reflection angle of incidence equal to angle of reflection so substitute this value so here so d equal to 180 degree minus i plus r equal to i so angle of deviation equal to 180 degree minus 2i this is obtained by the law of reflection angle of deviation can be derived by the glancing angle so what is glancing angle so here alpha is a glancing angle the angle between a o and o x that is a o x is called glancing angle angle between the incident ray and reflecting plane mirror surface is called glancing angle here a o x is equal to alpha and then b o y is equal to alpha y o c is equal to alpha so angle of deviation b o c equal to 2 alpha so angle of deviation d equal to 2 into alpha